Hey Jiffle fam, welcome and welcome back. I'm Vina and this is Pull Off Joy where I share my wellness journey. And in today's video, it is part two of my wedding planning series. <laughs> um, today is October 22nd, 2022, 10-22-22. And I'm going to see my third venue, so to speak. I'm about to meet my same, one of my same best friends that I went to the other venue with last time. At this point, it's about three weeks ago. Um, we're going to see another venue today. Um, this venue um, has everything included in the per person price. So that's gratuity, taxes, and the service fee is all in the price. So there's no really hit, no hidden fees unless we want to upgrade the package or add additional um food items or you know just like little upgrades if we want to do that would be the only like additional price that we wouldn't account it for at the beginning you know um it's a we're had we're still having the friday wedding um and there is a hundred person minimum so we just have to have at least a hundred people there if not they still going to charge us for a hundred people so we might as well fill those seats right so yeah, that is where I'm on my way. I'm on my way to meet her so we can go to this place to see what it looks like. Um, I got good vibes off the bat when I talked to this place. I mean, I know it's their job to make their, uh, have their customers feel special and they definitely did. So I'm excited. It has, um, everything can be on site, the ceremony and the reception. There's plenty of hotels in the area, but I still may choose a different hotel to stay at um because it'll be closer to where i want to take pictures at before the ceremony um what else and it has that little suite where the wedding party can be at before and after the, uh, the ceremony and also utilize and put our stuff in throughout the night um so it's a one hour ceremony time with a one hour cocktail and four hour reception so yeah it is in our budget um and yeah we still are on will probably be a little like three thousand dollars over but um i am having help additional help like between my sister my mom my god mom and maybe even i don't know who else a few other people maybe be pitching in for the, a lot for that extra cost that extra three thousand or so um but i really don't want to um let go of some of the, the non-negotiables like a good photographer good video videographer um so some of the things that are needed are needed like you know i might scale back on a few things oh also i don't have to do any decorating that's included in like the planning portion of the wedding is also included at this venue so they take care of the linens cutlery and all that stuff they also take care of fresh flowers so i can have fresh flowers and i just probably buy maybe a hundred dollars or two hundred dollars worth of extra decor to have on the table and they'll set that up for me as well so um, i probably just want white flowers and then a few of the faux flowers that i would want that be like the pop of color with some other um decor so you'll see you'll see as we get closer along but yeah a lot of things are included in that price so I'm excited. I'm excited to see this new venue. Oh, that's another thing. So I, when I talked to this new venue that I'm going to see today, um, they told me that I could come see it and that um, we picked a date where they were actually having a ceremony or a wedding. So I'll be able to see the event space set up at, as a wedding. Um, so yeah, I'm excited about that. Um, I didn't call them or nothing to double check that I was still good to come today, but I'm pretty sure I am. They told me to be there by two. Or around two o'clock so i'm gonna do that right now it's 12 37 so i'm about to pick up my friend we got like maybe two stops to make and then we'll be on our way there so um hopefully i'll be able to film a little bit when i get there to kind of show you guys if not i'll pop in some pictures and then i will circle back with you guys once i drop her off to let you all know how i like it but i'm excited i think i'm gonna like it i think this is gonna be the place i'm pretty sure being a planner and like being ahead of things <laughs> uh it's a blessing and a curse because it's like the planner in me wants to like get shit done but also it is a lot all these decisions and you think about this money that you really have like we haven't really saved any money for this wedding so we're saving the money as we go along and good things like we can just put deposits down 
and uh you know pretty much stack the money up until we don't have to pay the f the rest of the money until like a month prior to the event which is a blessing so um we're literally saving money for this in our house <laughs> so it's a lot it's a lot to think about like manage and make sure that you are planning accordingly and that you're not going too far out of your budget um, because I'm a spender and I like to give so I'm like oh I want to give gifts and I got to reel it in a little bit I'm like look girl this is about you guys like yes you throwing this big party <laughs> huge party but um it's also about like doing the thing that you guys want to do and make, making sure the day is special for you too so I'm trying to reel it in a little bit not to go too far um and I'm excited on the direction it's going so yes yeah, sis I'm gonna call y'all back when I'm done with looking at this venue and hopefully I'll be able to record a few clips to show you what it all looks like. Yeah, I, this is what I really want. Like I want it to be just like, like this. Like this. Yeah. Yep. And this is set up for 120? Yes. Okay. Wow. I'm like, wait a minute. Okay. Yeah, I was like, uh, Okay. Okay. Which makes it really nice if your guests want to have a private right. conversation, you're able to come back here and take it and do just that. Um, parking is for coffee and tea. Okay. But if you want to use it for a candy station, or somebody who's going to use it for a donut wall, um, okay. then we'll just move coffee and tea to a six foot table. Now, are you thinking about there? Pan. This is so beautiful. It's so freaking peaceful. Wow. Right? Wow. This is like perfect. Like we really don't need to go anywhere else to take pictures. Hey fam, so I'm back. I'm waiting for one of my other besties. We're gonna go to dinner here soon. But I just got done dropping off my other best friend. I always say my best friend because I don't have a lot of friends. All my best, all my friends are like my best friends who are also my bridesmaids. So I just dropped off one of my bridesmaids who went to the venue with me. And I'm meeting another one of my bridesmaids um, for dinner tonight. But Whew, that's a little bright um the venue was amazing i will insert some video and pictures here if i haven't already and this time i can honestly say that i'm pretty sure that we're going to go with this venue i have to talk things over with my boyfriend of course but i'm pretty sure that this one is 100 doable 100 in our budget literally we don't have to do anything but show up they take care of the decor the flowers fresh flowers um setting up taking things down the catering the day of coordinating um literally everything all we have to do is come show up we can take pictures on site as well because they have a lot of different areas on site outside that we can take pictures at um so yeah I'm pretty sure that we're going to go with this venue. I'm super excited about it. We got good vibes from her, from the, um, I guess I'll call her the, the event manager there. We had great 
good vibes, good conversation. We was there for about maybe an hour. I think we were there for like a good hour. Um, she let us take video and pictures, of course, of the how it's going to be set up. So literally, that's the setup that you're seeing right now. It will be the setup of how it would be. Um, one half of the ballroom will be for the ceremony because we're having an indoor ceremony. And then after the ceremony is over, all of our guests will go into like the common area for like five minutes while they um, basically set up the whole ballroom. They take down that partition and the whole ballroom converts into seating and everything for a dinner. In the video you see the um, the colors are similar to what we want to do. So I guess I can kind of tell you I want to do, um, I told you guys I think boho chic and um, our colors is like um, terracotta or like burnt orange with pops of um, like cream and green. So like green, like I want greenery and stuff. Um, kind of bring like the outs the outdoors in. So literally the table settings was like perfect with the wooden board, with the centerpieces. They literally take care of all of it. What you saw there in the ballroom, they take care of the linens, the table settings, the everything. Card numbers, I mean, um, table numbers, everything. I do have to take care of my own seating chart, but everything else they take care of. So literally it's like a one-stop shop. The only thing I would have to get is a DJ, what is, which is um, already got and that's gifted to me. Photography and videography, um, an officiant, and that's pretty much it. Of course, I gotta still, we still have to get um, my dress, his um, suit, he's getting something made. Um, finish paying off our honeymoon, which is easy and stationary. And what else? Oh, maybe transportation. Yeah, guys, I'm pretty sure this is it. <laughs> We're going to go with this. And I'm super excited about it. Ooh, my hand. I have um, a placeholder set of rings. Um, funny enough, this event, this person did ask to see my ring and I had to give her a spiel like, We're doing things a little unconventional. We're planning the wedding and then he's going to propose within the next six months or so. So <laughs> I don't know when it's going to happen. It can happen tomorrow. It can happen in six months i don't know but here soon it'll be happening so i don't have to worry about it but she was like oh, well, i can't wait to see the ring when you do get it. i was like yeah me too <laughs> but good vibes i'm super excited yeah it's all feel like it's coming together it just was a great feeling well that's another thing she said um on monday i need to email her let her know that we want to go along or go forward with the venue and then she'll send over our contract and then from two weeks once we receive the contract we have two weeks from that date to put down our deposit on the date so yeah fam that is it for today's video thank you for coming along with me on this journey i'm super excited for everything that that's to come and i will see you guys in the next wedding planning video again thank you so much for watching make sure you take time out today and every day to find your joy and i'll see you soon love you all peace